Yesterday, today, and tomorrow. What got you mad? I want to know why you mad. Why the fuck is you mad? So, Why You Mad is a new segment on the Mad Deep podcast. Yep. Where the different cast members speak on current events or various topics that seem to have people in an uproar because... Mm -hmm. There's no place where people express frustration Man, more. Man, just tell me why you fucking mad. Than these YouTube screeds. I'm not mad. I'm not mad, but apparently a lot of people are. Due to a comment that I made on... Uh, it was either Hater World or Food Community. Shout out to both comment of them. Section. I think it was Hater Worlds. It's I want to. Hater World, I, I want to say it was Hater Worlds. I made a comment. Um, where the 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 post was. SPM, a.k.a. South Park Mexican. And no, I'm not talking about the episode of, of South Park where Cartman goes as Casa Bonita. Uh -huh. I'm talking about the rapper from Texas, from SPM. Texas. Okay, no, no. I, let, Got it. But let's show him his respect as an artist that he deserves. Texas rap legend slash convicted child molester. He's a Texas rap legend. He is also a convicted child molester. I've never heard a single SPM song in my life. I mean, you were also born in 2007, so... Well, no, I was born in 2000, but I... Bro, I have literally never heard a single SPM song. You have, probably. You, like, like one of Can your... you name one? Damned if you do, damned if I don't. Like, you, like, you, damned if I don't, damned if I do. You never heard that shit? Never. You've heard that shit. Yeah. So, you, he, so he's popping, but he's a... So, 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 so first of all... First of all, here, here, here's, here's like, so we'll get into him and his charges. Okay. But just to create the proper context, I made a comment where the Hater World announced that this October, SBM has been locked up for damn near two decades. It's been like since the early 2000s. We're talking close to 20 years. He's been locked up. Right, if not twenty years, he's been locked up. Uh, the it said South Park Mexican or SPM is being released in October. My comment was, "Damned if he do, damned if he don't." Well, he's not invited to any quinceañeras. Keep him away, boy. Okay, that that was my comment. First of all, clearly it's a motherfucking joke, but also. I made every single syllable of what I said. Like, you know what I mean? Why is there like still like I don't get it, bro. So so he is a highly revered rap legend out of Texas. Now and, and what oh. seemed to what what I noticed in the comment section is there's this undercurrent of um this non existent rivalry between Tejanos and California right. Chicanos. Yeah. California Chicanos. Stupidest beef This ever. has nothing to do with that. It has, first of all, nothing to do with that. Second of all, I'm not trying to claim I'm anything that I'm not. If Rasa is a mind state and a way of life, and you guys consider me Rasa, then I'm fucking with you. If, regardless, I still am fucking with you. I'm a soy Italiano, white boy from West LA, grew up around all races in one of the most culturally diverse areas in America. The people that showed me love first, I always said, were brown and black people. And those are the Stop people. Playing. And those are the we people. We out here. You know what I mean? And those are the people who I fucks with. You feel me? Like, right. I fucks with my Chicanos and just, you know, Latino people in general. Shouts to all races, though. This isn't about races. And the yeah. fact that people automatically go to this divisive state yep. is yeah. quite troubling. Especially because... Whether or not it's Rasa on Rasa or Vario on Vario or gang on gang or race on race, none of that fucking matters. There's way bigger problems at hand in the world right now. And it's beyond race, socioeconomic status, gender, any of that shit. Yeah. Yeah. What we're dealing with right now is we're, there's literally... We're, our country is three million dollars in debt to China. I mean, they trillion, want though. Three trillion dollars. That's a bag, right? In, di in, in debt to China. They want money. this land. You feel me? Like, mm -hmm. there's a lot of things going on in the world. The conflict in the Gaza Strip. There are so many 
things where they're in ways that they're trying to divide us. That shit like this is insignificant. And we should be focused on getting money and utilizing our resources to come together. Uh, Period. What, what Yo, so, what, what's this got to do with SPM molesting people? <laughs> no, that's look, what I want so, to so, 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 shouts to, um, shouts to American Cholo. My homeboy Gil, you feel me? Go check out his YouTube channel. He has an entire video where he reads the direct paperwork uh -huh. from SPM. Yeah. A lot of people think he's convicted of statutory rape, of having a child with an underage woman. Now, I'm going to even like, I don't condone that in any capacity, right? Yeah, of course not. But I understand there are cultural, there's certain cultural differences. There's certain parts of the world in Europe in parts of Latin America, in parts of every single civilization where it's very, very common. As common as this generation, definitely very common in our parents' and grandparents' generations where the man will be significantly older than the woman. You ain't got to like, like, like ask some of your family members in different parts of, I don't give a fuck if you're from Latin America, if you're Italian like me, whatever. There's people where there's 50 year old men with teenage girls. I find it disgusting, but this is a, this is a cultural norm in other places. But why are there still people defending him if the paperwork is out? I don't get it. Cause I've, because I've heard they this love, before. They, they, they love his music so much mm. and they try, this is not like Cali foods versus like, I love there's not too many people that respect Texas rap. Like I'm doing an entire documentary Shout about it. All our Texas people, yeah, man. Shout, Shout out to out Texas, Texas, man. Salud, 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 we love salud. Texas. As, as long and, as y'all solid and y'all real ones and y'all respectful, we fuck with y'all. You know? not, not, not to mention like Tejano rap and like going back to Chingo Bling, going back to you know like the, the whole new wave, the the Mexican OT and and D and all these different fools that are just like going up right now in Texas. It it's seems like, like nobody in Cali really peso peso like. To be like, uh, I don't think anyone in Cali wants to support SPM, but I feel like a lot of people in Texas want to support SPM. We have uh, better Mexican food. I'll say that. Okay. Shouts, yeah. shouts to Barbacoa. You feel me? But yeah. like, like, and like, y'all have your opinion on that. I think we have better Mexican food. That Texas Mexican food is BS, man. It's all Americanized. So, I mean, with that being said, sorry. You not sorry. This they, opinion. They, they consider Taco Bell Mexican food. Yeah. Chill, chill, chill. Man, Texas, y'all tripping. See, this is why people be tripping. We, we be clowning, <laughs> but we don't, there's no animal. Animosity, and this isn't an LA no, food Texas. versus Texas yeah, like foods like we say, whatsoever. We really, but, San Diego but, got but, the best food, to be honest. But people are trying to turn it into that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's lame as They're well. trying to make this whole divisive thing, like, where it's, uh, you know, like, Cali Pools versus Texas Pools. Like, we're not discrediting Texas. We're not discrediting San Antonio, uh, Dallas, Fort Worth, El Paso, Houston, any of the surrounding areas. Like we're not discrediting y'all, your hip hop, your gangsterism, or anything like that. When we just say we're not with no chomo shit, and yeah, I wasn't even making a serious like like will I still slap his music? No, I'm not really gonna be urgently slapping his music. You know what? I'll be honest with you. R. Kelly made significant, in my opinion, R. Kelly made significantly better music than. PM. I loved R. Kelly's music. I can, can't really listen to that shit no more. You feel me? Yeah. If I hear, move your body like a snake, ma. Like, like you feel me? Like, well, I might in the back of my head still be like, yeah. Just like if I hear, damned if I do, damned if I don't. I'm, I'm going to be like, yeah. But I don't fuck with supporting any type of chobo activities, chobo rappers, people with them type of charges. This isn't a diss to Texas. This isn't a diss to him as an artist because he was a great artist. But I'm not fucking with that. If y'all are fucking with that and willing to look look past that, that's on y'all. But this isn't to be done in a divisive nature. This is one man's opinion. I ain't claiming to be shit. The fact that other media outlets are emphasizing my opinion and they want to put it on blast to that degree, I appreciate it. But it's not like anything I'm specifically aiming for. But do you think when he gets out, he's going to have people that, like, are rocking with him? Like, is he, is he going to be, like, safe? Is he going to be able bro, to, like, perform and shit? he has a bunch of people shit? rocking with him, bro. Yeah, I mean, I mean, like, I don't know. Is he, I feel like he's going to be, like, safe when he comes out. I feel like, of course he has a bunch of people rocking with him, but he's a legend. Do you feel me? Like, yeah. but there's also, I mean, that, there is a lot of debates about, like, okay, you Texas, like, he's accepted out there in LA, we not rocking with that. This is what people have been saying. This is not what I'm saying. You feel me? Uh, I'm sure there's people in Texas too that that don't rock with that. And I'm sure there's. I know for a fact because I've seen in the comments. What part of Texas is, is, is uh? He's from, from the South Park region of Texas, which is, which is uh, Houston, which is like a like a like a hood 
in Houston. Got it, okay. You feel me? Like, I believe in the south side of Houston. I could be mistaken. Forgive me if I'm mistaken. So yeah. South Park is in Houston. Yeah. Are they fucking with him in Houston? I mean, he is a this. This would be the equivalent of like I don't want to say any names because and they'd be like, oh, "Are you calling me a chomo?" Like, right. like one of our rap legends. If one of our rap legends went to jail for like, I mean, Mystical went to jail prison for years for rape. I don't know who that is. He was a legendary rapper from uh, Louisiana. I'm shout out from to Baton Rouge. You feel me? Like, I mean, no, wait, I mean, no, shout out to him. No, shout out to him. Sorry, sorry, sorry. No, shout out to him. My bad, my bad, my bad. You never heard "Shake That Ass." Watch yourself. <laughs> Yo, Shake wait. That ass. Do Show anti me. shout out. Anti shout out. <laughs> We're not editing your shout out out. No. <laughs> you didn't mean it like that. It was funny though. Yeah. No. <laughs> oh my. The, 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 the point is, the point is, at the end of the day, Ayo, Kenny, what the fuck? Like motherfuckers need to take a joke. It ain't that serious. You feel me? Like facts. Especially like like the idea of of obviously like you you just even if like let's say he's innocent and the eight women according to the paperwork eight? that American Cholo said the eight underage women that corroborated the stories the, the, and by the, the way the eight children if you if if, if you read American yeah the eight girls excuse eight me girl, the eight, eight girls children they're not women yet yeah exactly. the, his charges were not for impregnating a thirteen year old girl which is what most people believe his charges were for molesting a nine year old girl. For licking, it said something about licking. Yeah, yeah, we don't need to get oh, too specific. Kind of just shit. you know, we don't want to get it's demonetized. But crazy, yeah, crazy ass shit. That this was crazy. on the paperwork. You can look at American Cholo's channel. We'll put the link in the description. You feel me? And you can peep the peep, read the paperwork yourself. Like for example, Lefty Gunplay. When he was on our podcast, before he knew that, he's like, I fuck with SPM, da 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 He fucking uh, heard the... He, he freestyled over an SPM beat, right? Yeah. Then... He uh, was the, the paperwork was brought to his attention by the hater world, and he said he is never listening to another SPM song again, and you don't support him. That's coming from Lefty Gunplay. He publicly said this, so you know what I mean. Like, yeah. and I'm not telling you like that's the barometer for how you should form your own opinion. He, each individual is free to form their own opinion, but you know, Lefty is a highly respected person in in LA right now and beyond. So it's just like I'm not saying take accordance with his opinion, but th there's an example. Of somebody who gets respects opinion. He did and 20 years. SPM has been locked up for damn near 20, I want to say. Yeah. That sounds nuts. Especially getting locked up for what he got locked up for. Yeah. I mean, like, now the Texas penal system, no pause. The Texas penal system is very, um, uh, is very strict. Mm. You know, it's a very strict. They're, they're one of the only states that openly practice capital punishment, the death penalty. Um, I'm looking up right now when uh, SPM was locked up. When was SPM locked up? Like 03 maybe, right? If it was 03. Um, yeah, like 2003, right? If he's doing 20 years and he's getting out this year. Oh, maybe 2007. Something like that. Hold on a sec. Uh, my miss, my miss typed it. Um, but... Regardless, at the end of the day, um, you know, this isn't an admonishment of Texas. This isn't an attack on y'all. This isn't an attack on him as an artist. This is an attack on him as a human being and his basic moral compass. And done in the in the fact that a motherfucker can't even joke about it without you getting in your feelings. You're really thinking about the wrong things. Like I said, there's way bigger things and more important things to people to worry about. So people got mad at you for that? I mean like I would there's a lot of people that are butthurt by that. Like guy. what did so you said you quoted a lyric, right? I, I quoted a lyric as a joke. You feel me like damned if you do, <laughs> damned if you don't get out. Because the thing is October uh, 2024, he gets out. I said, damn if you do, damn if you don't. But he's not invited to any quinceañeras. Okay. Honestly, whoever hates <laughs> Which on is Lush, fucking hilarious. Like, whoever hates on Lush is a fucking bot. You're a so bot. he was locked up in 2002 is when he was convicted. So he's been locked up for over 20 years. Hmm. 22 years when he gets out. Damn, that's crazy, man. That's nuts. Yeah, I'm not fucking with bro. Again, the Texas, uh, I said penal system earlier. It is called that. But yeah. let's just say for the sake of uh, non-posery, the justice system in the state of Texas is known for being particularly harsh. You know what I'm saying? Um, with, 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 uh, with those type of people? Unless it's crashing out. <laughs> 
Yeah, with individuals such okay, as that. Okay, yeah, for sure, for sure, for sure, for sure, yeah. How do we end this? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It's over. This it's was over. Mad Deep. Uh, why are you mad? <laughs> Lush Crash. You still oh. mad, motherfucker? You still mad? <laughs> <laughs> you hey, man. Shout, out to, man. shout out to shout out to everybody. <laughs> Yo, let's watch that. Actually, I kind of want to. No, watch that, that was fire. That was fire. I want to watch that ending. I want to. I want to watch. That's that. not a great. Yeah, that's pretty funny.